What's going on, everybody? Finally got up my creek far enough here on my biggest gravel bar and uh, took the old kayak up here today. Kind of risque because the skies are getting dark. And this is the creek I was just talking about the other day, flash flooding. So hopefully I'm not doing something crazy here, but it seems crazy enough already. But I knew I wanted to get this covered before the next rain came through because as you can see, I mean, look at the solid tree right here. See the flood debris six feet over the bank from right here where I'm standing. I mean, some of this got laid over, but this was 15 feet deep here. And it's some of the highest I've ever seen this creek. And um, that's my phone case thing, if anybody's wondering. <laughs> I don't leave trash land in the creek. Hate seeing it. Hate seeing stuff that I can't pack out of here. But uh, anywho, uh, I went yesterday and obviously didn't throw no videos up. I went for like six hours, sweated like crazy, freaking toughed it out, went all the way down to the end. Uh, forgot three brokes, and maybe I'll show them in a vid later on. But I won't bore you too long here. Um, like I say, it's just now starting to rain. I'm hoping this little squall runs around me rather than run me over. But I'm coming along here, and I have got quite the in to here. This is not actually the gravel bar I found my monster at Leon, but it's just up around the bend here. So this could be his brother, like I was always talking about. Check him out. And that sucker is still going. See that back in there? He's a little roughed up, but you can tell it's still going. Oh man, check it out. That's what I'm talking about, man. This edge does look pretty rough, but who can complain? I mean, it's at least uh, probably four, four and a half showing right now. I mean, that's big. That is big. All right, before I get rained on here, let's do a slow reveal. Yeah. Not too bad. Not too bad. <laughs> yeah check it out that's what I'm talking about the nicest Etley ever comes off of this gravel bar that's got some size to it that's the that's probably the second biggest one I've ever found in here I'm just gonna pull it oh wow Gosh. Whew. Wow. Dang. Oh, it's hard to believe you walked this creek for uh, 10 years or better. And there's still monsters like this laying in here. It's just crazy to think what you just walk, you know, inches from just not, you just can't see one layer down in this gravel and the wind's really starting to pick up now hope that don't sound too bad on your end there there's the beast that'll make up for tomorrow already oh look at that raining and sunshine i'll take it yeah folks that's what i'm after you can see my middle finger is three and a half my palms about four yeah it's about four and a half four and three quarter something along that line but i do have my kayak and my car is downstream so if the water starts coming up i guess i'm just gonna have to bail jump in and hope like heck i don't get a flash flood to come up behind me <laughs> actually i shouldn't be laughing but you never know this is kind of dangerous being in a watershed while it's thunder while it's thunderstorming somewhere, which should be obviously coming out of the west. So this is a eastern, well it runs west, so I shouldn't have to worry about rain getting in front of me too bad, not unless it completely goes around me. But I guess anything's a possibility. All right. 
running all over the five minute mark here so I'll let you go that's the first one for the day hopefully that's just starting it off I'm just getting to where I left off my first uh, my first gravel bar earlier I uh, uh, come on. Had this dude. Big old Schneider. Never found a Schneider up here. This is where I find my hardens, so it's kind of ironic. Because down there is where I find Schneiders. <laughs> Flip flop. But we'll try to get you something up. And hopefully there's more to come. If not, that right there. We'll do the trick. Take it easy, man.